phrases, Victor Hugo, no army can stop an idea whose time has come. No army. As I've said a thousand times, I'll say it again. Most violent revolutions fail or create something worse. In fact, almost all of them. Most of the American Revolution in 1776 was not physical. 3% started it, 5% won it against an empire who'd never been defeated. We lost almost every battle, but we won the hearts and minds in the end, and the King of England had to sue for peace. It was a culture war, but they wouldn't let the patriots deliver the newspapers, the Federalist Papers, the committees of correspondence, and so it had to be defended by arms. Seven years of perseverance in the face of an empire that defeated the French, the Spanish, the Portuguese, the Austrians, the Dutch, the Russians, and everyone else. We defeated it because we had superior ideas. And we have superior ideas right now. We got a handful of aces, all four of them. Nobody can beat that hand. But you got to play the hand. You got to know you have the hand. The enemy knows we have the hand, and they are you-know-what in bricks because they know the light of liberty that burns in our hearts and our minds is infectious. Let's start getting into the State of the Union before I get into all the other news. Obama, community college, should be free. We'll get to that. And he's speaking to young people that play on their iPads all day and everything's paid for by mommy and daddy that have no idea they have no future. They want to sucker them in just like they put all the federal money into education, driving up the price of it. When you put free money into it, it's not free. It inflates the cost. And there's not even a, an economy or an industry for 90 plus percent of those jobs. Now, I was telling you that 20 years ago. Rush Limbaugh was telling you that 30 years ago. It's just a fact. And I'm not poo-pooing if you have a college degree. Great. The point is, good luck building a world, building a life with most of those degrees. Yeah, a law degree, yeah, if you're a good lawyer, yeah, doctor, you need it. Yeah, mathematician, engineer. You only need the degrees to get into those societies, those organizations. But past those, you're not getting a job. Criminal justice, yeah, I guess that's going to get bigger. But it doesn't matter. The society itself is falling apart. But the first clip is Obama taunting Republicans. Then we'll come back and get to... Obama and his community college uh, statement. And then John Bowen did a short boil down on who really wins as America loses the Millionaires Club. People that have made hundreds of millions of dollars since joining Congress, they're almost all Democrats. I just, I'm not saying the Republicans are, are, are wonderful. They're part of the same system. The point is the Democrats are the leaders of the pack. Who sung that 50 song? The leader of the pack. They're in there, they run the show, and they're making major bank, and they're exempt from everything they put on us. Insider trading, Obamacare, I mean, this is galactic-level hypocrisy in our face. Let's go to Obama taunting. I have no more campaigns to run. My only agenda... Is to destroy America for the bankers who hate freedom. I know, because I won both of them. Um, yeah, you've really dumbed America down and ran against uh, straw men. Yeah. Oh, you're a winner. Yeah, you're a real winner, Obama. <laughs> Isn't that funny? It's all Comedy Central now. My only agenda for the next two years is the same as the one I've had since the day I swore an oath on the steps. Yeah, that's to increase the middle class that you've cut in half. To do what I believe is best for America. Oh, you care about us. I mean, I'm going to throw up. I use that term too much. I'm going to throw up. But I, I, and then Boehner's back there. Who, and I predicted, it wasn't hard to predict that he would suddenly start giving these hardcore anti-Obama speeches. Because everybody knows he's a total fake and he's hanging on by his fingernails. So he's back there staring at Obama that he plays golf with and drinks with and smokes cigarettes with and does other things with. I'll guarantee you, those two are a piece of work. And, uh, and the Secret Service words about Obama, you wouldn't believe it, Alex. That's Bongino on air, but I've been told by other Secret Service, they just said, you wouldn't believe it. No, I'd believe it.
We know what we're dealing with here, deviants that want to screw over society. They get off on breaking the country. They hate us. They want to dominate us. What's the best way to keep a secret from somebody? Well, you give them something that they want so bad that they don't care what you're hiding. The year is 2007, and 20% of the state of California is employed in real estate. We live in a capitalistic nation of kings and prey upon the greed of the selfish pawns. Based on a true story. We created the American dream where everybody could qualify for one of these loans. Americans in select theaters, January 23rd. Attention all radio listeners. Survival Life is giving away free credit card knives exclusively to our radio listeners here today. Visit MyCreditCardKnife.com to see this covert knife in action and claim yours for free. It's the same knife you've seen in the airline magazines for $29.95, but today it's yours free. Just pay shipping and handling. MyCreditCardKnife.com, MyCreditCardKnife.com. Go now. This is a serious topic for all men. Every single man listening may have a prostate problem if he lives long enough. That's right. All of us men may suffer from a prostate problem, like urinating more often, waking at night to urinate, or problems with intimacy. That's why every man needs to call for a free bottle of Super Beta Prostate, a non-prescription formula guaranteed to reduce the symptoms of your enlarged prostate. It's free. Pay only shipping and handling. Just call 1-800-964-7470. Prostate problems may not be an issue of if. They can be an issue of when. Super Beta Prostate's ingredient is clinically shown to reduce urges to urinate, reduce waking at night to go, and help improve intimacy. Call for your free bottle. Just call 1-800-964-7470. That's 1-800-964-7470. Call 1-800-964-7470. Healthy elimination is essential to high energy, a cheerful mood, and prevention of disease. Some of the founders of our modern holistic health thinking state that disease begins in a toxic colon. A toxic intestinal tract is the foundation for virtually all degenerative disease. And a clean and well-moving intestinal tract is the foundation of health. I just want to say that you folks have an amazing product. I've taken whey protein products for years, and I've never noticed results I have with your product. I've suffered with thoughts of constipation most of my life. Within a few days of taking One World Way, I noticed a dramatic change. Also, in the past few years, I've experienced symptoms associated with diabetes. I feel horrible when I've had too much sugar, and I've been getting the foot pain as well. But I've noticed in the past week or so, I'm not feeling bad anymore, and the foot pain is gone. I'm just finishing up a five-pound top I ordered and just got off the phone ordering more. I love your product. Thank you. Call 888-988-3325. That's 888-988-3325. Or visit OneWorldWay.com. That's one world, W-H-E-Y.com. You ever hear about Ghost 80% AR-15 rifle kits? At Guns80.com, they are the 80% specialists, helping to protect our privacy. Look, there are forces out there right now trying to register guns for future confiscation. UN treaties threatening our Second Amendment, our freedom. You need a Ghost AR-15. Get it at Guns80.com. Call 844-2-GUNS-80. That's 844-248-6780. Own an AR-15 today and keep it a secret. Go to guns80.com. That's guns80.com. 844-2-GUNS-80. Virtually anyone can hack your cell phone and track your calls, your texts, your emails, your every movement, but only if they can detect a signal. Stay one step ahead of hackers and Big Brother with a block at Pocket, a custom-made pocket infused with pure silver that creates a complete Faraday enclosure for your cell phone. For free shipping to the lower 48, visit BlockItPocket.com or call 888-315-9618, BlockItPocket.com, enhancing health and privacy. a video we're going to post up to prisonplanet.com and infowars.com in a few minutes. It's two minutes of John Boehner's disgusting uh, micro expressions during the State of the Union where he was uh, sitting behind Obama looking like he was passing gallbladder stones. And it's all part of an act that he doesn't like Obama when he's the one that won't repeal Obamacare that's illegal that's a fraud, that's a giant scam that we were lied to on every front. Now the IRS says they will garnish wages and grab bank accounts and hold back tax refunds.
but won't give you advice when you call them about how to comply with Obamacare. Isn't that Kafka-esque? That's the book, The Trial, where he's in a trial not knowing what he's even accused of. <laughs> That's what totalitarianism is, where you can't even comply because they won't even tell you what the unconstitutional regulations are. What the policies are. Well, here is Obama saying he will veto. Well, not if there's a big majority, he can't. He can get that past him. Obama basically saying that he will veto anything that tries to repeal the screw job act known as Obamacare. Here it is. We can't put the security of families at risk by taking away their health insurance or unraveling the new rules on Wall Street or refighting past battles on immigration when we've got to fix a broken system. And if a bill comes to my desk that tries to do any of these things, I will veto it. It will have earned my veto. Now, did you hear that on the immigration issue? No law has been passed. The laws say you can't have open borders or legalize illegals by fiat. You haven't even signed an executive order specifically with that. You just ordered the Border Patrol to give them vouchers and complete the, quote, smuggling process to, quote, the Border Patrol. So if Congress tries to pass another law blocking you, you'll veto that. I mean, you're seeing total lawlessness in everyone's face. Boehner clearly has been blackmailed. If you think our economy shut down under Obamacare starting to phase in, imagine when the carbon taxes hit that are already hit in California by fiat, which he also talked about. Let's go to this next clip. Uh, this is uh, Obama on how community college should be as, quote, free and universal in America as high school. Primary education cost about 10% of our GDP, if you look it up. Health care is another seventh. That's doubling, so now it'll be basically one-fifth. I mean, they're just taking the economy over and then special interest administer it and siphon off the tax money. That's why big corporations are behind Obamacare. That's why they're behind all these regulations to shut down small companies. This is a takeover. And that's why they got bipartisan support to keep Obamacare in place because 47% increase in profits in one year for global insurance companies just on the American people's backs. It's set to go up that much this year. You're talking almost a 100% increase in profits. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It's sick. Let's go to this clip. By the end of this decade, two in three job openings will require some higher education. Two in three. And yet we still live in a country where too many bright, striving Americans are priced out of the education they need. It's total horse crap. It's not fair to them. And it's sure not smart for our future. Oh, no. And that's why I'm sending this Congress a bold new plan to lower the cost of community college. To zero. To zero. That's pure bull. It doubles it in the second half. I mean, just with debt. I and mean, you sign on to a debt package. Another screw job. From the gangster. People love being gamed, though. They love being pimped. Keep in mind, 40% of our college students choose community college. Some are young and starting out. Some are older and looking for a better job. Some are veterans and single parents trying to transition back into the well, job. Veterans, market. it gets paid for, all of them. Just... Whoever you are. More lies. This plan is your chance to graduate ready for the new economy without a load of debt. The new economy. Understand, you've got to earn it. You've got to keep your grades up and graduate on time. Tennessee, a state with Republican leadership. All right, let's shut it down. I don't, I don't want to hear any more. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, the United States has more college graduates per capita than we've ever had. Every, everyone you know, thinks it's like this badge of power. I love how many people are bagging groceries at local HEB food stores that have 200 degrees. And then they'll look down their nose at me because, oh, you didn't get a college degree? Yeah, sorry, I was taking RTF. I was making, you know, 90s, 95s, but it was all 10-year-old information. So I went and just did it myself. See, I'm successful. Oh, that isn't the badge of any success. Living in a 400-square-foot apartment with cockroaches the size of chihuahuas with a giant debt for your degrees you can't pay off as winning? Well, you know what? Call me a big, fat loser. Ha, <laughs> ha.